today we are off to Porto Galera from Makati. It's always good to leave early. Below is it? Makati bus station at uh, Taft Avenue, Jam Liner. From Jam Liner, take bus going to Batangas Port. And that's going to take you around two hours or maybe less than two hours, depending on the traffic. So that's why I advise you guys to leave early morning. Batangas port, look for signboard, passenger terminal. Here you have two options, one is Sabang beach and the other one white sand beach. Don't mind this poor guy, enjoy your ride. <laughs> we bought tickets going to White Sand Beach, but unfortunately we were dropped at Sabang. But then we had free transportation going to White Sand Beach from Sabang, which is roughly around 15 minutes of travel. So welcome to Porto Galera. Day one in Porto Galera, we opted for inland tour. As you can see, you have around 15 places to see here. You can get this information while you're walking around White Sand Beach or around Sabang. There are many tour agents who's gonna offer you for various prices around 1,000 to 2,000 pesos. But if you approach any tricycle driver, pretty sure you're gonna end up paying only 500, maybe half of the price of tour agent is gonna offer you. But we opted only Tamara Falls which is the main attraction of Porto Galera inland tour.
This is very risky path as you can see there are a lot of rocky surfaces and the rocky man is with us <laughs> Can you see the, yeah, that's very dangerous waves. Commenter is there, eh? Yo, chuck the foot there, lag the gilly.